Hello there. <laughs> What's up guys, it's Jeremy here, and as you can see in the title, today's video is going to be an August favorites video. This video might be fairly short because I actually don't have a lot of favorites this month, which is so unusual because I usually have a lot, so that's a thing. But anyways, without further ado, let's get started with this video. So I'm gonna first start off with all the clothing pieces that I like this month, and this is actually one of them, you guys. It's basically a gray Armani exchange sweater, which by the way, Mainland Menswear sent to me, so thank you so much, Mainland Menswear, for sending me this piece. I absolutely love it. And if you guys don't know, Mainline Menswear is actually one of UK's largest independent designer menswear retailers. They happen to carry pieces from Armani Exchange, and I think they're actually launching their Autumn Winter 2017-2018 collection, and their entire collection is actually available in the Mainline Menswear website, so if you guys want to check that out, I will leave their information down in the description box down below. But basically, I got the gray Armani Exchange logo sweatshirt, and one thing that I like about this sweater that I also found unique was definitely the rib design to the cuffs of the long sleeves, and they also actually have it on the waistband. It also has the logo printed in the front with like a subtle large AX printed in gray, but overall, you guys, this sweater is so high quality and well built, and you can just tell by wearing it that it will last you a long long time. My next favorite is another piece that I got from Armani Exchange and I'm actually wearing it right now. It's basically a 100% polyester black shorts. I can't really show it to you guys unless I stand but I'm actually just gonna show like a different clip but I've been literally wearing the shorts when I'm inside or sometimes when I go outside when I do errands and stuff like that I do wear the shorts because it's so comfy. By the way guys I will try to link all the things that I've mentioned in this video in the description down below and if you guys want to check out Armani Exchange collection and potentially buy something you my code Jeremy10 to get 10% off. But anyways, the elastic waistband and the drawstring fastening is such a good duo, you guys. Like, it helps fit the shorts well to your waist. And it also has pockets, which I absolutely love. And they also included a zip fastening pocket in the back, which I found really nice because I could just, like, store my wallet there safely and no one could steal it or pickpocket me, you know? And of course, the rubberized Armani Exchange logo on the left side of the shorts. Again, a great quality shorts and I absolutely love wearing it because it's just, honestly, so comfy and, like, so nice. It's just so well built basically. My next favorite is just this red jacket that I got from a thrift store and I actually love this so much you guys like I always find really good pieces when I go to thrift stores because they honestly just store the unique ones if that makes sense so I would definitely recommend going thrift shopping if you have the chance because you will most likely find amazing vintage looking things and this one is kind of vintage but like not at the same time but it's still looking good and if you follow me on Instagram you've definitely seen this jacket because I posted a picture right here on my Instagram so if you don't follow me on Instagram yet I suggest you follow if you want only if you want it's at I'm Jeremy Clyde so yeah anyways I really like the fact that this jacket is slightly baggy on me because I really like oversized clothes and it's honestly such a pop of color which I really don't have on my wardrobe so I'm just really glad that I have found a red jacket for me and this jacket is also very comfy you guys so that's definitely a plus my next favorite is actually this fedora I actually posted a picture with this on Instagram the one that you just saw earlier but I've literally had this fedora for forever now and I didn't really start liking it until now I don't know why but but I've just been loving this lately. I've been wearing it and I just like it. I actually got a few DMs on Instagram where I got this uh, fedora because I didn't tag it on that picture. But I got this from H&M. It was only $25, I believe. But yeah, it's just a basic wool fedora and I actually like the uh, ribbon, the black ribbon detail around the hat. So yeah. My next favorite is just this squared um, sunglasses that I got from Aldo. And I got so many compliments, you guys, when I wear this. Like in school, when I just walk around, I will usually get like compliments saying that they look nice or when I go to like Panda Express or Starbucks like some people would like compliment it. It's like this gold metal framed um, sunglasses So it's like so it feels really well built and it looks expensive even though this was only like $14 I think so it wasn't that expensive, but honestly, it does look expensive It looks so high fashion and it's kind of big on me But I kind of like it at the same time So if I were to wear it, it would look like this on me and I absolutely just love it you guys like it probably doesn't look good with this outfit, but I mean, you get the point. But yeah, if you follow me on my social medias, you've definitely seen this sunglasses because it's pretty much everywhere. My next favorite is just this Are We Sweden watch, and I've actually shown this on my previous videos. I will leave that in the description down below, or put like a card in here where you can find it. I've actually been wearing this watch quite a lot because I love the mesh strap that they have, and I haven't really owned something like this before, like this type of watch, so I'm just glad that I got it. I've literally incorporated this watch in so many outfits, so yeah. I honestly just like the look that it gives. Like, it's very monochromatic, very high fashion looking, and I also like the dark navy blue background of the watch, if that makes sense. So yeah, I really like that, and I just like the overall silver details. My next favorite is actually this perfume that I got from Scentbird, and it's actually the, um, 
Burberry Brit Splash. So I've been using this a lot. As you can see, it's like half gone. And I've been using this a lot lately because I like to smell good and this cologne smells so good. And I literally put this in my car and my bag and pretty much everywhere I go because sometimes when I feel like I smell bad, I just spray one of these and I'm good to go. <coughs> and it smells so good. Like, honestly, it, it smells good but it doesn't taste good. <laughs> All right, so moving on to my favorite song for this month. My favorite song for this month is actually, <laughs> it's such a weird explicit title, but it's basically called, it's called Fuck Me and Feed Me by Rendezvous at Two. He said, hey, they won't need that. I've been waiting for a chance to say the ways I love you. So can I get underneath you? Okay, let's stop that because I feel like it's just so explicit, but I mean, I like the beat, I like how it flows, it's so a chill music, like I've legit had this song on repeat when I go to school, you know? My next favorite is actually a TV show that I just started watching and it's actually been out for a couple of years now, like six years ago, I think. But it's actually the show called Nikita, I don't know if you guys have heard it, but I've just heard it from someone. He recommended it to me, so I was like, okay, I'm gonna watch it, and I watched it, and I liked it, and now I've been watching it, but I have a lot to catch up because I'm barely on season one and um, that thing is uh, till season six, so um, great. But anyways, guys, that is pretty much it for my August favorites video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up, and if you want to see more videos of me, please subscribe because I do make videos every Monday and Thursday. And don't forget to follow me on my social medias. Links are down below so you guys can check that out. But other than that, I'll see you guys on Monday.